I already drained out the oil. Got her in the pan right here. No metal particles. I stuff has dropped in it. I mean, you can see there's like sand and whatnot around there. Because that oil pan was dirty before. But. just my mom moving stuff I didn't hear her come outside but I will get all that gasket maker peeled off of here and around here get everything all cleaned up now, one thing that I wanted to check is the clutch whenever you go to so whenever I have the clutch cable attached on the bike Whenever you hit the power band, it, um, the clutch slips. And I'm wondering out why. And whenever I have the cable off, it doesn't slip. I'm also going to have to drill and tap this. Because when I got the bike, it did not have the bolts in there. There's a little bit of one right in there. If not, I'll have to somewhere find an inner clutch hub. I don't know if the basket's supposed to be like that. I don't like that. But, all in all, we got the top end on there. It's got a lot of compression. <clears throat> So today I'm going to be taking off these bolts and checking out the push rod. These are all the bolts for the clutch case. So, let's see here. There's the push rod. This. It's a two-piece push rod. So let me try and dump the rest of the rod out. All right. I got the push rod thing figured out. Now what I'm gonna wanna do is take off the inner hub and I'm gonna have to drill out that one and then I think that I have an extra bolt for it if not I know I have bolt kits and stuff like that around here and I will get it figured out but for now what I think I'm going to do clicker into Hmm. Isn't it in here right now? Yep, I've got it stuffed full of towel and whatnot. 
so I can get that drilled out and so metal shavings don't fly around and get stuck all up in the motor. So I will be back when I find a drill and tap of the right size. So I'm back. Um, I did a little bit too much work off camera. I got carried away. I just never hit record. But right now I've got this drying. I have to probably wait about 40 more minutes. I got everything else cleaned up. Oops. Now I'm doing gasket maker on this one. And whenever you do gasket maker on the clutch cover, this hole for the water pump goes right around the clutch cover. And make sure that there isn't anything in there. One goes. That's just going to hold that in place. I wait for this to kind of thaw out because that stuff kind of freezes pretty quickly. I'll just see if so I can snug this one. Move the space so that way you can still move up and down. I just don't want to start crushing it yet. Now I'm going to dip the ends in there with a blue thread locker. not crushed yet so now I can take out that one Yeah. 